In this video, I will be sharing with you tips and tricks to stay consistent on YouTube. Take all my mind, take all the joy now, take me down, take all the love now, tie me away, burn me alive now, break me down right now. Now you wanna lock me away, I'm winning, you wanna add to my pain. I'm Before we begin this video, I want to first of all apologize because if you hear any sound in the background, my baby is right here with me. Hi love, hi honey, my baby is right here so... Well, the show must go on. <laughs> I just want to wrap up the video because why not? The show must go on. <laughs> What's up, beautiful people? It's your girl, Janet O, and you're welcome to my channel. If you are new, if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Guys, in today's video, I will be sharing with you tips and tricks to stay consistent on YouTube, whether you are a mom or you have a side job or anything. T these tips are you know, how to make you stay consistent on YouTube no matter what. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and you know, turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. So without further ado, let's dive into the video. Number one, at number one tip to stay consistent on YouTube is writing down your ideas. You guys, I have, I have a whole book, yeah, this big, for my for youtube like whatever i whatever idea i think of because when you're not thinking about it sometimes the idea just pops up and you want to immediately write it down before you forget you know that way you have what to film when you want to film a video that way you will not run out of ideas that way you will always have a video to film and since I have been doing, I, I just recently started doing this, mind you. And since I have been doing it, it has been working for me so far. And I am enjoying it. Yeah, my son is right there. <laughs> and I am enjoying it. And seriously, if you start doing this, you will thank me later. <laughs> so at number two, you want to film multiple videos when you have the time. Yep. It's right there. I just filled the tea. You want to film multiple videos when you have the time. Being a mom, I try, I tend to manage my time when I have it, you guys. Multitasking, doing YouTube, being a full time mom, it's mind blowing and hectic. So, what I do when I have the time to film, I mostly film weekends because my man will be home by then helping me take care of our baby while I, you know, film for you guys, <laughs> film videos like this for you guys. So what I do, because I only have Saturday and Sunday free. So what I do is I try to film as much as possible and just edit them during the week, you know, while holding my baby or while he's sleeping or you know, while I have teeny tiny bit of time, I just edit them one after the other. But what I do is I film them and I put them on the, I have them on my phone. You know, I have them to go. I don't know what you, I, I don't know if you understand what I mean. Filming multiple videos a day, that way you have, you have a video when you upload, when you want to upload, there should be a video. There is a video for you to upload. You have a video to go. That way you have a video to upload when you, whenever you want to upload a video. At number two is set a video day. I already told you I have weekends to film, which is Saturday and Sunday. So set a video day. Set your upload day and set your filming day. So for me, my filming day, now I'm trying to make it like twice a week, you know, Wednesdays and Saturdays, I'm trying to, whew, I hope I can, but I'm trying to, you know, extend it to twice a week. I usually upload videos once a week, every Saturday, but I just figured, well, since I have so many videos laying around, why not upload them anyway? So I want to um, extend mine to twice a week. So what I'm trying to say is have an upload day and a filming day. So you can manage your time, you know, 
create time for you so you can have that time to upload that time uploading is not really it's not really the the main thing the main thing here is filming so you have to create time you have to make sure okay this is the time i have free and i am dedicating this time to youtube so you see you want to have an, an upload day and a filming day so you you will be good to go <laughs> so you guys at number four we have setting your goals set goals to stay motivated you guys you know youtube is hard <laughs> yeah really youtube is hard and you really really need to be motivated to be able to do youtube so that is why you need to set goals you need to know what you want where you need to set a target a goal you want to meet by the end of the month by the end of the week but you know you want to upload the, 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 the amount of videos in a month the, the, the amount of videos in a week so you have to set goals that way and you have to take your goals seriously that is another thing you have to take your goals seriously that way you can be able to make more videos you can be able to stay consistent because you want to meet your target because you want to meet your goal so set goals to stay motivated set 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 <laughs> at number five we have keeping things simple yep keeping things simple so being a youtuber i know you have, you want to put everything out there you want to you know stand out and the rest but when you are someone who don't have much time like i do when you are someone who i don't know maybe you have a side job or i don't know if you're not um, doing youtube full time but you want to manage your time and split your time between youtube and whatever else you're doing you want to keep things simple you want to manage the time you want to you know keep the you just want to do it and go you don't have much time to spend making one video over you know you don't have hours and hours and hours to spend making one video like today if i if i tell you guys that today i filmed four videos you will not believe me because why i'm keeping things simple because i have to just do them and go do them and go i don't have much time to wait because if my son will start crying i don't know maybe he's getting hungry or whatnot and then before you know it it's it's late the daylight is gone as you can see i'm close to a window the daylight is gone and you're losing time so you see you want to just keep things something you can just you know do and you just do and go do it you're done with it and you go mm -hmm. so you want to keep things simple that way that is that will really really help you a lot you want to get it over and done with already without wasting so much time you want to keep things simple your thumbnail should be simple you know something you can edit really quick just put a picture there put a picture there put words if you're putting words but just make it simple you don't have to start cutting erasing backgrounds and so on and so on. it doesn't have to be really really dramatic just something simple that you can do and get it over and done with <laughs> At number six, you want to be organized. I already said this before, you want to be organized. You want to have your videos organized, your editing apps organized, your whatever you're using on YouTube, you want to have them organized and ready to go. Like I said, this video is how to stay consistent when you don't have time. So you want to have everything organized when you know and ready to go you want to have all your videos you want to you know put your video ideas all organized and ready to film that's why i said you need a book a youtube book i don't know if you want to use a book old-fashioned way you know pen and paper to write down your ideas or you want to just put it on your laptop your smartphones wherever you want to put your ideas but you have to you want to have them organized to be ready to film and done with that is another step <laughs> last but not least you want to pre-film what is pre-filming pre-filming is filming a teeny tiny bit when you can and then finishing it later just you know you want to pre-film you want to film a little bit when you have time a little bit here and there and then edit them back together when you can you know 
that way you want to you will stay consistent that way you will have a video that way all you need to do is film a little bit when you have time film a little bit here and there and then later you can edit them together as long as you stay on the same topic as long as you stay on the same message that you're passing or on the same uh oh, i don't know video yeah, you just want to be on the same track. You just want to be on the same video idea, on the same topic and everything. And it doesn't matter if you film one in the bedroom and you film one in the bathroom, as long as you're on the same topic. So the people can follow the idea and, know, and also understand it from there. Okay, you guys, that is it for the video. That is it for the tips and tricks to stay consistent on YouTube because we all have to be consistent. Why not? So... Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking with me till the end. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you found this video helpful. Give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking with me. And I will see you all in my next video. XO.